Damien Sogren here in beautiful Constant Spring Golf Course in Sweet Jamaica. It's Kingston's Carnival and it's Carnival Friday. It's all about hooky right now. Anybody who's here today, they are ducking out on their work or other obligations and let's say you're having a good time, enjoying music, full breakfast, lunch and of course a really gigantic pool to cool off from the hot, hot, hot heat. It's all about hooky vibes right now. And of course, you know, it's, it's really hot in Jamaica, but thank you for delivering a pool, a big pool for everybody to cool down. One of the hooky organizers here. Tell us about the hooky brand. Uh, so, you know, hooky is actually a Washington DC based brand. Uh, we've been going actually for about probably 15 years. We started in university, wow. but the actual hooky brand has been going strong for 10 years. And we're actually doing our 10th anniversary in Washington DC this year. But this is our second year in Jamaica, and we're here trying to organize Jamaica and make sure we bring the hooky brand and the hooky flavor down here for you guys. Excellent. And of course, what, let, let everybody know out there, what, what is unique about Jamaica's carnival that you have had to bring your brand to Jamaica? So the thing about Jamaica's carnival is they have shown so much immense growth over the last couple of years. I mean, when you talk about carnivals and, you know, carnivals throughout the Caribbean, they're like growing and expanding and soca is going mainstream now. So Jamaica, they literally turned the corner in a few years. Jamaica's had a carnival for a long time, but in terms of being in the mainstream, it has, it has become at the forefront of people's consciousness the last couple of years, especially people who go to Trinidad and stuff. They, I've heard debates yeah, about man. people like, how I gonna organize my Jamaica trip after I go to Trinidad? But Jamaica is wonderful because it's accessible in terms of flights, you know, your accommodations are cheap. And I mean, you can't complain anytime you're in the land of wood and water, you know yeah. what I'm saying? I love it, I love it. You heard it right here. You do the double. You go to Trinidad's Carnival, then you go to Jamaica right after. Let's take in some of that hooky pool vibes and action. Yeah. Oh my goodness, I am here with a wonderful audience. I love your tattoos, by the way. Thank you, thank you. Where are you from? Toronto. Toronto, great. So you're beating the cool here today at Hooky? Yes. Nice. So you're enjoying Hooky, by the way? A lot, yeah, I love it. It's great. What about it stands out to you? Everything, the pool, the food, all-inclusive liquor. We don't do that at home, so it's nice to have all of that. So, like, my belly's full, I'm drunk, the sun is nice, it's perfect. I love it. Yeah, you can't beat that. You're satisfied, right? Shout out to your folks right home at Toronto right now who are freezing their, their, their bodies right now. Tell them something. Um, sorry you didn't come with me. I mean, you should be here. It's dope. Um, I miss y'all and it's going to be great when I get home. And Hookie's dope. I need to come back next year. You should definitely be here next year. All right. Yes, yes. Oh my goodness. The hooky vibes. Trust me. Every Carnival Friday in Jamaica, you need to make it your priority to check out this one-of-a-kind pool party. The Hooky Entertainment crew definitely made a splash. I mean, literally. There's a big pool. They made an awesome splash here today. The Carnival vibes continue on your One Caribbean Television Festival Fix. <laughs> 